Hello friends, welcome to my channel Crochet Hustle. This is a chapter 2 of how to crochet for absolute beginner. Today I will show you how to single crochet. In chapter 1 I showed you how to hold your yarn and hook, how to slip stitch and how to chain stitch. If you missed the video I will leave the link in the description below. Hope you have practiced how to do the chains and you are comfortable to hold your yarn and hook. So let's begin. We will do single crochet in the chains. You have to remember that a single crochet is equivalent to one chain. So before making the single crochet I will make a chain. Then from the second chain from the hook one, two, I will do single crochet in this second chain. You can see these two threads in this chain. Put your hook in between the threads like this. Then wrap your yarn in your hook, pull down your hook and pull out. There are two stitches now. Then again yarn over and pull through the two stitches together. This is the first single crochet. Again, put your hook through the next chain, yarn over, pull down your hook and pull through. There will be two stitches in your hook, yarn over and pull through two stitches together. This is the second single crochet. Again, put your hook through the chain, yarn over, pull through. Again, yarn over, pull through. I will show you up close again. This is the next chain. You can see these two threads and the gap in between. I will put my hook in the gap like this then wrap my yarn this is called yarn over then pull my hook through the stitch and yarn over again and pull through the two stitches of my hook again as you can see i am doing it very slowly at first you have to do it very slowly then after um, you have and after you are comfortable enough you can see that your speed have grown you have just have to be uh, very patient while doing it don't rush your stitches Uh, do not uh, tighten your stitches too much. Your hands should be relaxed and in comfortable positions. This is the last chain. And the first row of single crochet is complete. This is how it will look. I have said previously that a single crochet is equivalent to chain 1. So first I will make chain 1. Then turn my work like this. The stitches look, uh, the stitches look like this. Same as the chain stitches. But we will not work in between the threads. We will look below the stitches. You can see that below the stitches there are gaps. You have to put your hook through the gap like this. 
then yarn over and pull through yarn over pull through again in the next stitch put your yarn through the stitch yarn over pull through yarn over pull through again in the next stitch yarn over pull through yarn over pull through the two stitches up close it will look like this you can see the single crochets of the first rows first row you have to put your hook in the gap here just below the first thread this thread you have to put your hook just below it and pull through then yarn over pull down your hook pull through there will be two stitches in your hook yarn over pull through again put your hook through the stitch yarn over pull through yarn over pull through I'll say it again that you have to be very patient while doing crocheting for the first time and keep your hand relaxed you don't have to uh, hold your yarn too tightly or hold your hook too tightly And of course, do not miss the last stitch. This is the last stitch. Do it the same as before. And my second row of single crochet is complete. It will look like this. So keep practicing. In the next video, I will show you how to do half double crochet, double crochet and triple crochet. So goodbye.